every every lieutenant kill except for the admin. Nice. And for the last one on Hartmore, we got to the guy and he's inside the spawn closet. And so one of the guys like, be careful not to shoot him in there because like doors close and then, you know, mission fails because we can't get his code dead. So we're standing outside and the guy won't come out. So we're running by the front door trying to like coax him out. He won't come out, but he'll, he'll, he'll shoot at us from inside there. And so we keep trying to coax him out and then some guy like, went right up to his face and danced around and he shot him and then we had a like kind of edge in and med gun med gun him from the maximum range of the med gun and then we find and none of us had a tractor beam so we thought we could kill him and tractor beam him out real quick so we finally came up with the plan is we have because we were in a little squad of four people so we thought well three of us will dance around in front of him to get his attention and then and one guy will run in and get behind him and just start bumping him, push, nudging him out. We did that, it took us about like three or four tries of that and we kept on having to switch out because um, the guy would finally get mad and turn around and then start shooting at the guy inside. We finally nudged him far enough out and then we, we, put, we put his ass down. <laughs> It's always the inventive ways. Yeah, people are saying they had to like shoot and throw grenades in there and stuff like that would happen. Yeah, my and then I thought I'm not gonna play another one because that one was so much fun. Yeah, you know, I can't beat it. and That's a good way to end. Yeah, go out on top. <laughs> but then like yeah, you know, I, I I logged on the next day and I'm fucking it was the last day and it was about like three or four hours before the whole event ended. And I just got the edge. I was like, I'm going to go back in. I'll just go and see if I can loot something good, maybe. So I went in naked. Because that last one I did, I was in my full nice armor. Got some compliments on it and everything. But then I went out naked the, the very last one. Just got like a you know, random set of armor and FS9. And then started looting rounds for it. But then I met up just randomly with this group of three other guys. And we went... Um, all the way through Hartmore, but I'd never been more injured than that run. Is I I end up with I start out right away with like getting a tier two head damage and a tier one torso, and then by the end I had a tier two torso, tier two head. So I kept on having to med gun myself because my vision would get all blurry and I couldn't see. It was actually, it was damn fun because it just, you're trying, in fact, I ended up draining my whole med gun just uh, on myself. <laughs> I should have looked around more. Uh, well, I can't really see with all the uh, snow blowing everywhere, but I think we are, I believe it is to the left of the ship. Oh, I thought, uh, I was looking at something off to the side and I thought, oh, crate parked right next to it, but it was your, you went into the VTOL. So it was the part of yeah. the engine of the of the cuddy. Well, here let's uh, let's open up this side door. We will uh, deploy machine guns. See what we can see. Does this yet yeah, has one on each side? I know we can we can dual dual. I mean I can't you can't see. <laughs> um, here you want you want a pistol or you want a machine gun? Um. I'll take the pistol. Du, 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 place. Oh, you got a suppressor on your pistol too. Yeah, I like little, that. A little suppressed uh, pistol, and then here, let me drop this in my, another clip for it. Should be by my feet. This is on the should. The equip. Even matches your armor, so that's good. Yeah, but I was going to comment on that. You do the same thing I do. Is I like to find the gun skin that yeah. uh, oh, there it is, that matches the, the armor. Equip this. Yeah, I don't get enough pistol play, so I need more. Pre I mean, make sure it did them right. So I see the package marker. I don't even think I can make out any buildings here. Maybe like the outline of some building or some structures how come it doesn't have i just got 13 total ammo it doesn't look like hear me stand up oh was it empty i mean i just bought it so i might have bought it empty or something um 
Wait, here, here it is on my. Get out of the way. Yeah, thirteen, thirteen on my belt. Oh, maybe the gun is empty. No, me comes full. Me. Thirteen zero, but it says I have thirteen in the gun and zero on my belt, which seems like it should be opposite. I mean, oh, there it is. I just had to, I had to pull it out once to update all the numbers. All right, I'm jumping out. Yeah, Oof. go for it. I'll uh. Oh. <laughs> I can I can uh, just provide covering fire at, at without seeing anything. Wait, come on, grip this thing. Oh, here it is right here. We're right next to it. Yeah, we're pretty close. I tried to land, like, right on it. It's not letting me grab the guns anyway. It's gonna bug. Okay, no, I've got him now. Eh. Is this one of those, like, colonial outposts? Yeah. So, I mean, the visibility's not good, but there should be a bunch of uh, ruins around. Different little yeah, next structures. To, next to like one big wall. Oh, there's like a, like a guard tower maybe ahead of us. This is actually cool because I've never been to this place and like I remember what the there it is. Yeah, I don't see anything. Oh, I don't know how it's laid out, and... Yeah, I've never been to this one. Oh, I thought this was a guard tower, but it's just a piece of the reclaimer. But there's stuff you can find oh, out here. I see a... Uh, like a raised platform. Yeah, you can find, like, old artifacts and things. There's all sorts of weird, weird stuff you can get. Don't... Oh yeah, but look, there's more stuff ahead too. I'm gonna go out this way. Oh, this is bigger than I thought it was. I really like this storm to stop. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm pretty far from you, and I'm, I'm under like what looks like some kind of raised guard tower. But I'm like 40 meters from you. But I haven't seen a. NPC yet. Yeah, I don't know if they just aren't gonna spawn or if there's they just as a chance they do or don't spawn. Here we go. I think this is a guard tower maybe. Oh yeah, you're right next to one with like it has even like a little flag on top. Yeah. Oh, I, I found the package. All right. Nice. Yeah, I'm not seeing anybody out here. Maybe I can climb these boxes. One. The yellow one in there. Did you see it? I think that was it. So here, I'll, I'll get it. Since you, you have the rifle. Yeah, let me. Let me. I'm gonna. Here's a ladder. If you can climb up. No, it's on the ground. <laughs> oh, I mean, I'm just kind of exploring. Oh. Okay, I got it. Nice, nice. Deliver package. I think it's a new Babbage, maybe. Yeah, there's nothing up here. Oh, yeah, you're at the top there. Yeah, I don't see anything up here. I think people were, people were saying that they were publishing the, the directions to this place so you can come without getting the mission. Oh, that so could I be. Bet, so I bet people come out here and then you'll kill all the NPCs and then... Yeah, it's only 40 kilometers from New Babbage, too. Ship nearby. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, that's the that's the wreckage making that noise. That's cool. I think. I think that's the wreckage. I'm walking back to the steel so I can drop this off. Yeah, I'm coming with you. Yeah, I bet they heard there's one that everybody says, like, you can go to this one, it's, like, real close to New Babbage. So this is probably the favorite of, you know, to come out and just, you know, sightsee.
Uh oh. You ship right. What's up? I walk up the back ramp and the interior of your ship is not uh, populated. Huh. I can like, it. there's only like, I can see all the way up to the cockpit seat and there's... You wanna try oh, coming gorgeous. in and see if, it, see if it pops up? Oh yeah, there it is, it just popped in. Right. But I get scared when that happens. i put this up here. Place. A little bit anticlimactic, but still interesting nonetheless. Yeah, just to see the sights. That was well, also yeah, kind of. Or, or freeze to death. <laughs> well, yeah, that's. I mean, since I'm in the heavy armor, that was a benefit. Is I had no environmental timer at all. But I thought it was like minus 65 degrees. So if I just kept my light armor, I would have been out, you know, I probably had like 10 minutes out there. And I would have had to keep running back to the ship to warm up. I'll have to get above this weather. Some altitude here before we start heading over to New Babbage. At least it's close. And then we can pick up some guns. Yeah, we'll check out the Black Kite after this. That is a cool mission. The Cutlass Steel has the... Like, they fixed the Cutlass Black's white model where the nose is constantly pulling down. But the Cutlass Steel has that problem still, so if I, if I like center my oh. mouse, it just nose dives. <laughs> yeah, I remember when I first, because I had flown the Cutlass for so long, that like really took me off guard. Is, well, what's up to the... Oh, it's New Babbage. I thought there's there's some little other thing out here. <laughs> like, yeah, the city. <laughs> yeah, it took me off guard because I had flown the Cutlass black for so long is after that when that pass came out with that bug is i start flying in the atmosphere and i went into the oh i must have been flying towards like an outpost i went back into the map to select the outpost again so i could get the little marker for it and then i came back you know i closed my moby glass and i was flying straight down at the ground you know at a high speed yeah. I had to pull up, what the fuck? And I think I almost nosedived right into the ground. In fact, I would have if I would have stayed like one more second in the Moby Glass, I wouldn't have had enough time to pull out of the dive. It's funny how you justify bugs in your head when you're playing this game, because I thought like, what the hell they changed this for? I thought, oh yeah, I guess it makes sense because the, uh, you know, Cutlass Black is not that aerodynamic. Yeah. So, you know, it should, you know, handle poorly in atmosphere. And the next patch came out and they fixed it. And it's like, no, it's just a bug. <laughs> you give the benefit of the doubt. It's like, yeah, they're just trying to be extra immersive. It's something they could even be like, no, no, it's not a bug. This is totally how we intended it. Save themselves some work. Where are you going? There's a uh, rooftop pad over here. Oh, for the package? Yeah. And we'll uh, we can hop over to the commons and get some weapons, or we can go out to Mikkel Five. I think is the one we're going to. But I, for some reason, I thought you were flying over to the um, uh, to the your. Know, the ex external entrances to the common. I thought, this is not the direction for that. <laughs> centered landing here, more or less. All I can see from the outside. Let's see what the steel looks like. Oh, this is like this kind of the color of my of my Freelancer Max black chrome paint. 
Yeah, I, I really like the metallic look this thing has. In. Yeah, so my my freelancer and my uh... and I'm incapacitated. No way. Yeah, it's the the uh, the ramp killed me. I think. Nice. Oh, wait. Uh... <laughs> I'm, I like, I'm like dead at the foot of the ramp. Oh, this is weird. If I look out the back ramp, I'm looking into space. But if I look out the side door, I can see the rooftop. So here, let me jump. Yeah, out it this might way. be might be wise to avoid the ramp. Oh wait, I'm not incapacitated anymore. Oh I'm yeah, not... you're standing. It gave me the it gave me an hour timer. That was weird. Oh, because we're are we in that search and rescue area? Yeah, we're in in the new Babbage zone. Okay, all right. Yeah, because that always confuses me. If you can get that happened, I think when I was when we were out here with brevity driving around. Is I injured myself somehow, and then I... Yeah, this is weird. If I look through the back door again... Oh, they're just painted in. But the side door is the cutlass look... Oh. Yeah, from some angles... Is the... All... All the interior disappears. Let's see if I can walk up the back ramp again and just paints in. Boom. Yeah, but as soon as I enter it, it all paints in in a flash. Yeah, weird. All right. Yeah, if I look out the back door, I'm just looking out into space again. But I can, oh, <laughs> I saw your marker, then all of a sudden, boom, there you are. <laughs> Let's see. All right, I'm going to share the next mission, Seize the Data, which is the Black Kite mission. So, sharing. A black kite. Yeah, and really, it's up to you if you want to get weapons here or you want to get them out at the uh, Lagrange station. I, actually, I guess there's no guarantee that Lagrange station has them, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's go over the commons then. I can sit on the bed. Yeah. Sit. Took one of those jump seats. Oh yeah, I should have done that. Let me go back there real quick. I'll, I'll leave the uh, I'll leave the doors open so you get a view, or maybe not, depending on the glitch. Actually, the side doors are the ones that were working. So here, I'll sit in this nice. All right, oh, yeah, wow. that's a watch. Or yeah, before can... they added the yeah you know, the this gra the acceleration issue is. I think you can see it when Kate Kate's original series it was like called like Elite Commander Play Star Citizen. Yeah. And she went like four months making that series, but if you go back and watch those, is one of her favorite things she used to do because she was you in awe of the game. She would you know, be coming into a place like this, open the side doors of the cuddy and stand in the opening and just like watch the scenery, you know, coming into like one of the landing zones thing like god damn this game looks good really does just that coming from the lead is like you know the only thing you ever saw on the ground was you know those like you know the 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 moon type planets with no atmosphere and just i actually you know. forget where this entrance is exactly there's four domes it's oh, right I... in it's, <laughs> it's inside the y of the let me guess is uh, it by all these other cutlasses that are landed <laughs> Yeah, the easiest way to find it is you see the spaceport and the train tracks coming out and they kind of Y out. Yeah. And it's it's inside that Y right by... Oh, yeah, I see you're at the right place now. And not all the uh, bunch of Cutlass Steels, I guess. Look at that. It's funny. Everybody Thank has the you. same idea. I can find just see to, out the side doors. Find me to button this sucker up. Close all the doors on me. Oh, sorry. I'm worried, I'm worried about ship theft. Can't 
close the side doors in the steel? There should be a way. There's got to be a button somewhere. But the gun's in the way of it. Let's see. Maybe try this. Oh, wait, there it is. Closed door. All right. Another cutty steel. Oh, there is a lot. I, I just hit the uh, external uh, cam when you mentioned it. I was uh, just like watching see. up the side. I think, oh, you know what this is? Take a look at the color over here. This is the uh, Nine Tails Cutlass that comes for the reinforcements. And you can steal, you can kill them and steal the ship. So that's why it has this color as a Nine Tails paint color. Oh, uh, yeah. I guess it's just a, a regular. Pack. Yeah, it's just a regular one. Mentioning about stealing ships. You left the back door open. We yeah, look, there's, there's in bodies hand. in here. Hey, you want some guns? There's some guns in here. There's a shotgun, P4, some armor. Yeah, I'll grab one of them just... Wait, why is it letting me? Maybe because oh, oh, it's uh, armor system. Yeah, right. Dude's trusting. After he stole the ship himself, he leaves it just <laughs> wide open for stealage. It could it could be uh, one of those bait bait ships, like they have the bait cars for car thieves. Just waiting for us to steal it, and then they'll they'll swoop down. Oh yeah, and his buddies are up above. Just patrolling, waiting. Like someone's gonna steal it soon. Just keep waiting. Or he could have just like stole it, flew back here, and just dumped it there. I swear, I wish I had like a little hover quad or motorcycle or whatever. Do you have one? No. Uh, cause I, I have a permanent um, dragon. Although dragon I guess with the jump seats, it won't fit, will it? Yeah, that's the bad thing about the steel is you lose all vehicle. I'm gonna wipe off my. I uh, I also I forget which which side has the gun store and center mass and all that. Yeah, this this way. This way. You gotta go through the little exercise area. The other one goes is the hallway to the bar. Yeah, this is this is the wrong way. Is it? Just the restaurant? Let's see. Yeah, this is the restaurant. Alright, I'll catch up with you. I need to go to Grisha's Greens and get a milkshake anyway. I was just here. This is where I dropped off that package to try out my that new trunk. I was I was just here a day or two ago. All right, the personal weapons. Let's see what my choices. Shotgun, a P8, P8, pistols. Oh, I can get the Lumina S. I never buy the Lumina because it's got the ammo looks exactly like the Galleon yes. ammo. 100 I did pick up, I did pick up some C54s in a uh, while doing um. So, oh, that was your know, common gun that you could just grab when you're coming in naked. Oh, I got that. Make it go to New Babbage. I'll get a C54 instead. You're welcome to put that silencer on it because I think the C54 takes the size one suppressor. Oh, they don't sell it here. They just have the uh, one and a or two and a three. 
Yeah, I mean, you can take the one off my pistol. I've got the uh, oh. size one suppressor oh, yeah. in it. that or not I think you're right is yep nice one put all these in my backpack put some on my belt wow got these heavies have a lot of room on the belt yeah, you can put a lot of magazines. So I used to like put like five on the medium, so I thought, yeah, twelve. That like that's two full belt, belt loads and still two more extra. But I think I can use up. No, I guess it's nine. Hi, hi. Uh, let me know if there's anything I can help you with. There. Yeah. This way you can still have. Because that's one thing is like if you, if you have a couple guns and a pistol and medium armor, you you can't you can't put too much stuff out. Yeah. You just have to start. <clears throat> that's on the end of SOO, oh, I was just taking your know, FS9, filling up the belt only with FS9s to so those huge like big drum magazines. So I had to look at my character and it looked like I was wearing this like, huge like you know those like wrestling championship belts. <laughs> Yeah, they're like clipping <laughs> through each other. It just makes a big. It's like wrapped around my whole waist. I used to come here to get the I ice pick hacker chip that they only sold here in the Apple store. Did I go the wrong way? I think I went the wrong way. Where's the exit? Uh oh I yeah. I don't know the way around here very well. Exit left, okay. Yeah, I was just following you. It's a, always, always a poor decision. <laughs> <laughs> this You had this as your home once. I had never had this as my home. I mean, that's just because I spawned here at the very beginning. I, I didn't really set this as home much after that, I don't think. Yeah, I think Brevity and I... Um, Recommended it to you, thinking like, "Oh, Cradle will like this because like it's such a scenic place." And then immediately we thought, "Oops!" and right past it. Yeah, really and that's what everybody recommends. All the guides are like, "Start new Babbage, start new Babbage." But then just you end up, uh, yeah, you know, with the frame rate. There we go. The frame rate problem here, especially for a new player, because you haven't you get the stock settings. I don't know, like, it, when I first started in Loreville, you know, I was getting, like, 5 SPS, and, you know, now I'm getting, like, 40 FPS at Loreville, because I, you know, just did the settings right. And I think in Kate's video, she said that, because she said, her original video, she said New Babbage as her start location. Not like this. This game is hard to play. And then about like video five, <clears throat> someone, <clears throat> excuse me, someone in the comments told her you had to adjust some of her settings. So she actually came back to New Babbage and you know, made this comment like, "Man, this is like night and day." Yeah, you triple your FPS. Yeah, okay. That was back when you um, you couldn't turn off volumetric clouds, but you could you could turn them like on medium. It was the lowest you could go. Come on, come on. Making me yeah, you have to like on. sprint and jump. It's that heavy armor doing it to you. Yeah, I can't. 
Um, try again. Oh, oh, almost got it. <laughs> this is the biggest challenge of the game. <laughs> there. Oh, 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 there we it. go. Yep, yep, you made it. All right. <laughs> that was hard, though. <laughs> I forget, when you're in the gunner seat, can you ping and scan? Like the, the V scan like you do for asteroids? Uh, actually, let me get in the... I'll get in the co-pilot seat. And... Oh, it's gonna get the turret? Maybe not, but maybe the... Yeah, co-pilot probably can. I like the co-pilot, but I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if the answer was no. I thought you would turn on the stuff here. No power on. Let me see if I can ping. Oh, you just sent out a ping. Okay. And how about if you hit B? Oh, B. Yep, I got a. Nice. All right, you're you're my yeah. sensors guy now. That will uh, become useful soon. The ship is so slow. Well, in fact, let me, uh, now I'm curious, because the one bad thing about the copilot seat is you can't swivel it. Let me go back in the turret, because that way I can look, you know, I can get 360 turret rotation. Do we, did we take the wrong cutlass? I just saw, like, a marker for a cutlass that we were pulling away from. Yeah, Drake cut this black 15, oh, 15 meters. Yeah, we're flying by a couple of ships. Oh, okay. Oh, and it was just the markers for the ones on the ground. Okay, yep, and uh, let me see if I can, yep, I can ping, and let me try that. Yep, and I can get the... Perfect. This, the scanner. All right, we are headed off to Mikkel 5. Bit of, bit of a trek. So, I don't know if you want to, like, play patty kick in the cargo hold or something. Shoot machine gun bullets into quantum and see what happens. I'm always scared. In fact, sometimes in quantum, I'm even scared to, like, look at my Moby glass, thinking, like, something's gonna go wrong. I mean, after I lost my ship that one time by falling out of it just by walking around, it was like, I'm not getting out of my seat anymore. Yeah, I don't know if this whole, like, acceleration effect is supposed to be there, because if, if you watch, like, old videos of, you know, back at, like, 314, um, is, you know, people used to give, you know, they'd hop into some, like, a Carrick and jump from, you know, like, Crusader out to Microtech, and they would, everybody would get out of their seats, and uh, the guy that owned the ship would give, everybody a full tour of the Carrick while they were quantum jumping and you just it, it seems like they've made that type of you know game and even like you know, think of like the Starship Enterprise if if every time you know they you know they turned on the engines everybody had to sit down you know, that'd be a hard shit to live on yeah for sure do you think ships like the Carrick, you, you know, the if you're like you're playing like the doctor role, you should be able to move around the you know, the sick bay and not care if the ship was flying or stationary. Yeah, I'd like to save your life, but the uh, the pilot <laughs> of the ship has a heavy foot on the accelerator. Yeah, I'm I'm just as likely to remove an organ and stitch it up at this point. Let me see the. Last. All right, so yeah, locate the black kite. Um, yes, yeah, so we should be able to get over there. And we're gonna have to either ping or scan for it. I'm not sure which one they mean. You read it. I should have it right. Accepted. Oh, I should get uh, my call to arms. Yeah. Let's put that in. Free cash. Use the data. Been hunting down.
I don't know what it is, but I've seen people bitching about the end of this being hard. <clears throat> well, we'll find out. We have. Oh, here it is. So we got the get a decryption key, then go to a server and decrypt it. And at the end here, it says we have to destroy the black kite. Oh, so now some of these comments make sense now that I was reading. I don't think we're have gonna, to, we got plenty of guns. Well, no, I, I think the way you have to... Um, oh, I wonder if you can just shoot it down. But it's a reclaimer, so I think those things are stout. But what you have to do is you have to get into the uh, your pilot seat and hit self-destruct. Oh, and then get and off. you get a timer, and um, but then people said they the the place from the pilot seat to the your closest place to exit the ship is pretty long, so you have to you have to hit it right, and you can't you, you can't be lost in there and make a bad turn or you die. And then the other thing people were saying is that then you get out of the ship. And you have to then get into your ship, fire it up, and get away before... Because when the reclaimer blows up, it takes out a pretty big bubble. So people were saying, even if they got out, um, they would still die. And that makes sense now. Oh, so here's what we do. Since I'm in the heavy armor, I won't be able to run fast. So we'll find... We'll, we'll kill everybody in there and do all the decryption stuff. And then when it comes up that we have to destroy it, we'll map, we'll go to the pilot seat, make sure we know the, you know, the way out, you know, back to the airlock. And then, um, then is I'll exit the airlock. You go back down to the pilot seat and get ready since you're in the smaller armor, you can run faster. <clears throat> and That's, then I'll... Oh, there it is. That's the ship. Well, that was easy. <laughs> I thought we were gonna have to search for it, but it's like right there. I guess it's because it's so big. Yeah. I'm still of the opinion we can just go back to the ship and shoot it, but we will. We will see. Maybe that like avoids those a crime stat that, or something. But all the reclaimer is like the heaviest armored ship in the game. I believe this. Yeah, that's so a huge health pool. Fifty kilometers out. So I think what you need to do is when we get close enough, use the, uh, the scanner tool to scan it. Why? I think, is, I think is how that works. Let's see, hold on. Yeah, it says scan to locate the black kite. So I think we have to do that. Is it that red one ahead of us? Yeah. Scanning it now. Scan, scan, scan. Yeah, there it is. Objective complete. Yeah, it was useful. Yeah, it's weird. I don't know why, but it'll probably you tell like... you like guys are on board and stuff. Oh yeah, it's... I remember that from. Uh... I'm gonna be scanning it again. I remember that from. Um... Xeno threat. You could scan the cargo ships and it would tell you how many boxes and it would, you know, it would tell you people on board. Yeah, I'm not getting any. Well, maybe we're too far away from it still to get the detailed info. But yeah, what my plan was is I can get in the pilot seat, open up the back hatch, back it right up to the airlock. Then you can go down to the pilot seat, hit the self destruct button, run up. Uh, I think I think the reclaimer's got it's got real because I took a tour of it in in one of those expo things let me scan it again now that we're close but it's got lots of ladders and stuff to move between the decks but it's got real big industrial slow elevators So I think people said if you tried to 
At the end, if you tried to use the elevators, it was death. But then, you know, going up the ladders is... Yeah, there's airlocks, I think. Yeah, there's that airlock on the side. Yeah, that looks like... But yeah, that's what I was it, thinking. Right? Yeah, it's the one, the one with the light on. But yeah, what I was thinking is if, if, I, if I got in the pilot seat and then opened the back flap and just backed it right up and had the engines on and running, then you could hit the self-destruct, run up, come out the airlock, get in the ship, and then I could just hit the gas and accelerate away. As soon, in fact, I could watch you get in the back so I could hit the, you know, close the exterior and then just hit the gas and we, that should be their best chance of of using the self-destruct yet actually getting out alive. Let me see if I can... Oh yeah, now I can look out the back. Because my angle was a little off, but whatever. Where is the door? I thought I was lined up a little better, but I think I'm too high. I like that's... to use a slide door for EVA. Yeah, that's a better, better option. Yeah, I'm a little above it, but that's okay. Isn't there an elevator, like, next to the cockpit, though? Wouldn't you just, like, trigger the no, self-destruct and go out the elevator there? Because I think that that's an internal-only elevator, and so there's the big cargo one in the back that actually goes all the way down to the ground. Is it supposed to... You like this thing. This point. one that's up here. Hold on, let me find it. I guess we can, once we get inside... It's like right here under the, under the cockpit somewhere. Right up, man. Yes, there it is, right here. Call elevator. New objective, find decryption. Yeah, I guess I should keep up with <laughs> Yeah, this is the elevator that comes out to the ground. All right. I guess that makes sense, because how could you get in? Unless it's barbed. Just as the pilot. Yeah, it comes out from that big room right behind the pilot. I thought so. I may be... It may be very slow or something. Are you ready? I think so. Oh yeah, here's... This is it. Yeah, this, this, here's an elevator right here. That's must have been the one you were at. And that was the airlock on the other side, right in front of us. Oh, here's the server room. Oh, the model of the MSR. Uh-oh, what's this? Hello. Decryption key. Oh, nice. Okay, perfect. Right here on the desk. Go. Here, let me equip it so it's ready to... Can I equip this thing? I thought uh, it's a stand up. I thought you could put it on your belt. I gotta ditch one of my med pins. Oh, I can replace it. There we go. Okay, I got it equipped now, so I should be. Now let's see if there's, is there any place to insert it here? Probably in a different spot, they won't put, they wouldn't put the two together. I mean, yeah, they say servers, this looks like servers, but I don't see like a little... You're probably right. I have to check the ship. There's another door, it's just a little, yeah, it's a little right across bathroom. the hall. But this ship is so big, they would have to separate it just so you... Be another one where there's no people. Maybe the enemies aren't spawning today. This is the crew quarters, but <clears throat> this is like a, I think Nine Tails guys. So they they wouldn't be in. They're they're probably on the. Remember how the ship is laid out? This is the galley. 
They just ended that one expo. Is at the very back. There's this huge elevator that goes to like five different levels. <clears throat> so there's like a cargo level that has like a regular cargo your deck, and then there's um, yeah. Oh. Time for the full plan. Oh, nice. There's a guy. Maybe there's another one on this side. Let me look. I don't see one. In the middle. Anybody in here? No. It's clear yeah, so on the, my end. So the big elevator at the back. Oh, here's the elevator to the bridge. But there's. What if there's loot boxes? This... Oh, this is... Is this the, uh... Is this the repair, yeah, the... repair drone bay? Yeah. Or salvage and drone that... bay? And there's two seats out here for the drone operators. Let's see where these staircases go. And then this is the ladder down to the captain's oh, this, area. This staircase just goes uh, to a turret. Probably one on the other side, too. Who is this guy? Is this a Nine Tails guy? Yeah, I think they were Nine Tails. He had kind of a purple tent. Oh, this door just opened. What's, did you look in here? Your servers. Uh, I don't Check the other it. side. Uh, this is, looks like escape pods. Uh, oh, this is the this is the entrance to the big elevator, I think. Oh no! Oh, that's what we came from. <laughs> That's the kitchen. Oh, so uh, we are going in the wrong direction, so we have to go back the other... Down to the bridge, maybe? No, because the bridge is in the front, I think, and the big elevator's in the back, so right. it's... Right. In fact, I saw an elevator when we came in, and I assumed it was the bridge elevator. Because you were saying that you were seeing it from the outside. Oh, and there's staircase. Yeah, here's the airlocks with the two stair. Oh wait, this. I'm trying to piece together, you know, what I was reading in the yeah, comments. Yeah, where does all this go? I'll, I'll make sure we're both going down here, though, so in case there's like guys down here. What is even in the sub deck? I've never been down here. Oh, is that like engineering? Yeah, I can hear like you know, engine sounds and there's power cores and stuff. Yellow glows. Alright, so this is just. I remember the reclaimer having lots of ladders, so the thinking that's cool because a lot of the ships don't have ladders, but they would just have an elevator. I thought, you know, what happens if the power goes out? So where's where does this elevator go? Oh, ele oh here it is. This is the big elevator. Okay. See, it has all the doors. Oh, yeah. There's a door above us, salvage or something. Let's look at the pad. So there's salvage balcony, salvage processing, salvage hold, cargo hold, exit ship. And we're at the hab deck. So where should we go? Let's go salvage balcony, and then we can shoot down into it. Sounds like a plan. Salvage balcony, it's the top here. But they always taught me high ground is good. <laughs> so here we should see, oh yeah, I remember this now. Is, this, is that somebody? No. Oh, I see I'll somebody. Go. I guess if you go right, I can go left. The guys upstairs, I guess? Oh, I see yeah, somebody I just, walking around downstairs. I just got somebody up here in the deck. Right, there's up, a couple up, of guys up. down there. Okay, there's one. Got him. Oh, I see one over here. Oh! 
He's right behind. Oh, there's. I'm seeing like a lot of movement down there. There's another guy. You see that the thing with the big two on the side? Yeah. Kind of popping around for me. So. There we go. Got him. Yeah, the railing is getting in my way. Oh, I see some more movement running. Oh, there's some like computer terminals down there also. Probably, oh, that's probably, probably where it is. Yeah. Nice. Come on, let me. Can we jump onto like the top of these containers. I see two guys, but it's giving me like there's glass in between the railing. Yeah, we're gonna have to go down to get them. Yeah, I can't jump. I can't jump over the railing here. We're just gonna have to take the elevator. Oh, here's this railing's lower. Oh, but as soon as I try to aim, it. Oh wait. I, There's still one guy down there that uh, I'm going to have to get up close on personal. That's where I wish I brought some grenades. Oh, yeah. Just drop them on. Where's the button? Oh, there it is. Oh, All right, so that was salvage balcony. So habitation salvage processing. These ships are so huge. <laughs> They're really that big. And there's somewhere where you can see, like, this uh, corridor where all the chomping happens. You might have to just go look at that just for fun. Right side looks okay. Left. Seeing lots of, like, terminals, so we'll have to come back and check them for if... Oh, there he is. Right, insert decryption key. That's a. I don't know if that just changed or I just noticed it. I didn't, maybe that means we killed the last guy. So in the balcony, I saw one. Oh, is that you or? Uh, <laughs> so there's a tiger claw over here. I'm going to store that. Nice. Oh, yeah. I haven't been looking at... Uh... I'm surprised there's no loot boxes in here. Was it just laying on a, like, a shelf? Here's yeah. a whole bunch of terminals. Oh, here's the... Oop. Oh, is that you talking? No. Where is he? Maybe downstairs? I don't see him. Don't see any? I think I just saw the key. The place to insert, I mean, is next to this orange screen. Uh, oh, yeah, right above the Ace of Spades. The gun's in the way. I have to lower my gun. It's, oh, what is this thing? Oh, a burrito. <laughs> nice. Oh, I have to keep it. Uh... We're not just killing them, we're stealing their food. Forgot how to. Oh, shit! They just used a med pen. <laughs> I have to. Wait. And. How do I get. Somehow I can get the thing back. I'm just gonna go to inventory and do it. There's some button I can press that'll let me pick the the server key, but I can't remember hold, what it is. Hold C, I think. Oh yeah. There we go. There it is. Uh oh. Where is it? Got three med pens. Did it go into your backpack or something? Storage? Or I wonder if when I tried to equip it, I ended up actually dropping it. Let's see. Let's see. I have... Med pit, med pit, med pit empty. 
Yes, I don't have it anymore. God damn it. Oh, maybe check on the floor here because I, maybe I dropped it when I was fumbling right here. Oh, that's a burrito. <laughs> Store. Oh, here's my gun on the ground. Or is that the bad guy's gun? Yeah, Do I still have a gun on my guy. back? Yeah, yeah, you still got him. Alright, let's, uh... I know where the, uh... Did my tiger claw work? work? No, because it, it said decryption key. I, oh, I see it. There's a marker for it. <laughs> so we have to go back to the hab deck and pick it back up. Easiest part of the mission, and I couldn't handle it. Yeah, no worries. I mean, I, you equipped it, it probably just. No, it's the game. All elevator, come on. Hello, elevator. Here, you call it. Maybe I'm broken somehow. Give me like a chirping noise. Sounded like yeah. a no. Uh, don't tell me you can get elevator bugs in here. We can always drop down to the next level. At the end here, right? There's that little little gap we can hop down. I was, think, I was gonna see if there's a staircase up to the balcony from this room. jump down. I'll try it. You stay up here just in case. <gasps> oh, here it goes. It opened. It just popped open. I'll, I'll come right down. All right, I'll come down to that level. This is... That's, that's the guy that we heard, though. Argo hold, I guess. How do I get out of here? Oh, what's this? Way in the back here, how do I... Oh, I need a uh, salvage hold. I guess I should have looked in the cargo hold to see what's in there. But, uh, yeah, here we are. You see, you... I'm back behind... Oh, yeah, like a oh, jumping yeah. puzzle. Something to crawl around or climb through. Yeah, there's this little, like, hole here. Oh, I don't know how to get to where you are, though. See, like, a little small triangular thing, but I can't seem to get into it. Let me see if there's... Like, Oh, here I can climb up here. Yeah, it looks like you got a, there's like a gap. It's like, how are there no loot boxes in here? Should be full of good loot. armor is going to be oh like pop off our stone they can see you right there yeah. hi i mean i but guess I, I could wound you and then gravity gun you up do i have a gravity gun yes but here i can there's a box here i can step up on and then there's a how do i get up to this next level yeah this looks like i can climb from my side but if you can get up here oh 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 come on get up Get up! 
Oh, maybe can I climb up to the level I jump down? This is all opened up back here. And there's a guy down here, so it's almost they wanted you to come down here and kill him. Right. Alright, this. Why don't you. Do you see the marker for the decryption key? I do not. I make sure I got the mission tracked. Yeah, because I see a decryption key with the, the little diamond. Yes, okay. Why don't you go back and get that, and I will. I will experiment with different things back here. Ooh, an FS9. Grenade launcher. Oh, nice. All kinds of fun stuff back here, so it's... Just let me out. <laughs> oh, I wonder if... Do you have a tractor beam gun? Yeah. There's a... There might be some boxes that need to be moved. All right, I can come back and check on that. Looking at the cargo hold here to see if there's anything in it. They just noticed there's it's a like it's all garbage. square box on the side, and I can kind of get up to where it is, but then it's... Or there's another square box that is... If I can, I can hop up to a box, and then it's... It's right above that little triangular thing that if it was moved, I could just, you know, crouch right through a hole. So it looks like, yeah, there's two boxes that might be tractor beamable. That was an obvious uh, thing to bring on this mission, was tractor beam. <laughs> and you know they had them at New Babbage. <laughs> yeah, let's see if I can this guy has the fun loot on his body at least. Oh, there you go. So it, I grabbed his FS9. T54, FS9. See, now I wish I had bought that extra silencer. Grab his undersuit. Oh, I gotta take off all his gear. That totally worked. Alright, watch out, I'm gonna move this thing. Look at that. Oh, that's even a different one than I was expecting. Here, grab that grenade launcher. Uh, Taking off all this guy's armor so I can get to his undersuit. He's got a laminate Cobus undersuit that is, uh, All right. I do not oh, see here. a grenade launcher. Oh, there. Well, no. That's not. I'm gonna have to move some of these boxes. I just littered the floor a little bit. Where's the grenade launcher at? Oh, it was uh, right up by the box that you moved. Let me drop this. Oh, I might have knocked it Oh, somewhere. you might have put the box on top of it, maybe. It was right to the... Look different now that I've. Oh! That's my. Uh, the C is. It was like right around here. Let me move a couple more of these little armor boxes. It was like right to the. The right of that body if you were facing forward. Yeah. Oh well. Wait, what's this? Oh, here's my legs. <laughs> it's like I took off some of my armor by mistake. Drop. Let me, let me see what the state of my body is in. Nope, that's not going to do it. I'm going to face the right direction.
Yay! I lost my Thule legs. They're not in any of those. Oh shit, it just disappeared. <laughs> I was grabbing and moving those boxes of all the you know, Nine Tails modified stuff. And so I moved. Oh, oh, here, here it keeps on no, shooting up. ORC Mark X. Here it is, Thule legs. Oh! Okay, better, it better equip those. And yeah, I've got yeah, a gonna, couple. I can try to move it with the gravity gun if you want. Yeah, see, it looks like it keeps on appearing and disappearing. So grab, yeah. Remember that floor used to be bugged. If oh, here, in fact, pick it up and hold it. This is the right one. Oh, oh that's a modified. Modified. Oh, here is modified. Yeah, just hold it in the air, and I'll. Uh, equip. Nice. Have it back on. Oh, let's crouch down. Alright, I'm all. Did I lose anything? Oh, good, I did. That's the only compartment I didn't have anything in. <laughs> I don't even know how I took those things off. Alright, I'm glad it wasn't a jumping puzzle because, uh, I don't have armor that is good jumpable. Oh, you got the key, right? Uh, no. Didn't, didn't manage to make oh. it there. Um, yeah, you should be able to yeah, go through that thingy about her. Yeah, we gotta go up and get it. Yeah, it should be in that room with the hab deck. Well, not like clockwork, but we're getting it done. Yeah. If I ever come back, I'll know that, uh, how to get back into that secret compartment to kill that last guy. Yeah, that's useful and have, has a grenade launcher or some other special weapon, you, you know, machine gun. Alright, come on, come on, elevator. Don't tell me you're doing the thing again. How did you get to, to work last time? I just opened it. It, it just opened. It, it was slow. It just took it a while to open. I think it resets the elevator to some default position and you gotta wait for it to come back. Well, wait, it's actually, it's, now I'm reading something because, you know, they've done a couple hot fixes so far. One of the hot fixes they did to try to help the elevators is if the elevator doesn't respond in like 60 seconds, it like resets it and does, you know, does something to try to you know, kickstart it again. I hear it now. Yes, yeah, so if you call it and then it doesn't arrive in 60 seconds, then it deletes the elevator and respawns a new one. And then you can call it. Actually, so that's another nice thing to know because I wouldn't have remembered that unless we just had this experience. And that's exactly what happened because we were fucking around <laughs> and then 60 seconds yeah. later you can call it and we just did it again. Alright, so oh, yeah, yeah, there's the decryption key. Alrighty, I'll go grab yeah, it. Same. Oh, yeah, here it is. Okay, grab. I'm just gonna hold it. Yeah, you can just keep it in your hand because you need to. Uh, this is cool there. looking. This has like exposed it's wiring gold. and it's gold colored, yeah. Alright, so where we go next? Go salvage down to deck. Salvage, salvage processing. I like how I think the doors alternate in this. So half of them go off one side, and the other half, like the half deck, goes off in the other direction. Right, so this thing insert. Yeah, it's right next to the burrito. Just did it just disappeared. Data transfer incomplete. It's like sitting right here. Yeah, it came back out. Grab. Okay. Insert. Just... No. 
Oh, there it goes. Okay. It there just took it, just took it a moment. Oh, uh, yeah. So here, now destroy the black kite. You're saying we gotta we gotta do a self destruct run rather than blowing it up with the ship. Well, actually, we could try both. So we could actually go outside. What we could do is we'll we'll go find the. Why am I moving so slow? Oh, get to it. Let's go up to the hab deck. Here it's up. Uh, and we'll go up to the bridge elevator. <clears throat> And uh, sit in the seat and then turn off the shields. Oh, that's a good idea. And then we can go hop into the ship and try it. Oh, wait, there might be. Get your gun ready. There might be more uh, guys spawned in for this final phase. Heck dead. Here's the first guy we shot. Mm, didn't look I like can it. see him like spawning an extra guy here. Yeah, so this is the this is the ladder versus the, the gravity generator. Let's go elevator. Yeah, here's Please. this is the bridge elevators right here. This one? Okay. It says bridge. Thing down, I would have. Oh, this must have a. Uh... Oh yeah, the bridge is down by that big claw, I think. That comes off the front. Oh yeah, here's the the chomper. This thing's gonna look pretty cool when it's got like big chunks of metal coming through it. Yeah. Well, the turrets. The here. Here. Out. Yeah, so there's the bridge ahead of you. And these are the things for the remote tractor beam. So yeah, just... Is, but there's not an elevator, like, right here? Like another... Like, isn't this left side an elevator? Right? Oh, there's... It's empty. Is there a button? Yeah, call elevator. Right? This should this should take us right outside of the ship. Look it? how slow it's going. Yeah, I guess that's true. Oh, it's a single manor too. Or we can oh, try yeah. it the other way. <laughs> shoot it, shoot it, and see if we get credit. Now, see, what I think is these two ladders. I'm going up to. They come oh. up right to the airlock. Uh, looking around. Where am I? Oh, I'm at the gravity generator. Shields That's offline. not right. Alright, I got the shields offline. Alright, here, actually, I'm gonna count. I'm gonna count. So I'm gonna go from seat. Takes two seconds to get out of seat. So three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, wow. nine, ten. Uh, how do I go down? That's eleven, thirteen, fifteen. Yeah, I don't even. I don't even see how to go down. I don't see a control anywhere. Maybe it's only for entering the ship. Maybe it's broken, like the raft is broken. Yeah, I definitely would not be getting out of here in time, taking that elevator. Oh, in fact, that's because people said that the elevator's instant death, and that's maybe that they're talking about is that elevator is... Bugged. Here's the elevator back up. Yeah, yeah. figure, I've got four badgers. You can, you can use two panthers, right? That's a pretty good amount of guns. Did you go up to the gravity generators or yeah, anything? Yeah, so that's the gravity. There's nothing else up here. You just go straight to the gravity generator. That means it'd be nice if there's a ladder. Because you have to come out of the bridge and take this bridge elevator. Well, it's the, it's the same level, so I can, I'm can i up above the bridge elevator now. 
So they come oh. out next to each other. There's different doors on the same level. Oh, so you can get to the to the hab level? Yeah, so climbing the ladder brings you up to the hab level. <clears throat> Alright, so actually that's that's that that'll be faster than this bridge elevator. And you got to sprint all the way down the hab level to the uh, airlocks. Yeah, it should be right. All right, and then go go through the mess hall, through the captain crew quarters, and then run out the side. I don't know. I, don't, I mean, how long does it give you for the countdown? Uh, it do, it, it does have a countdown because I've heard people talk about that. Because like I think normally when I've hit the the self destruct, it doesn't give me a your countdown. I just I think the, the only time I've tried to do it and get out of my ship, I just uh oh What the fuck? What just happened? My ship is spinning. I think uh, I might have hit it. So I jumped out the airlock and it looked like I I was seeing infrastructure. Objective complete, destroy the black kite. Alright, where are you? I oh, I'm outside. You're floating, and uh, the black kite got destroyed. It's got 25k. Uh, yeah, because it's not, it's not around. Let me see if I can. I don't see your marker anywhere. I'm um, 150 from you. Oh, but you're you're floating away from me almost as fast as I can EVA. Yeah, here, let me get in the pilot seat. <laughs> I can see your marker moving around. I did not hit the self-destruct button. I just turned off the shields. No, because the self-destruct is big enough that it, it blows up everything and even ships parked nearby. All right, so I don't see you. I don't see your party marker. Yeah, just, um, uh, I'll tell you when to stop. Keep rotating your nose down. Oh, yeah, you just stop here because I can maneuver now that you're not moving away from me. Okay. We open up the side door because the back's giving me the oh it just painted in but i'm gonna go in this side door anyway oh yeah i see I like there it. you are okay weird you're not you're not in my party anymore i can still see you so i think that's just one of the one of those like normal um yeah you're, party okay bugs. yeah it's just a part party but that was insane was all right close it up yeah is the ship damaged i don't see any damage it doesn't look red on the display yeah, well, because well, I guess that's I one way to do it. Airlock. <laughs> yeah, I hopped out the airlock, and all of a sudden I saw, you know how you used to be able to like, your like when you're getting in your ship, it would put you like inside the ship, you know, superstructure, <laughs> and you would die. But yeah, because I saw like, like panels and yellow lights all around me, and then all of a sudden your ship was tumbling in front of me, and I thought what I had done is I had come out of the airlock and hit. The cutlass was knocked it. That doesn't make sense. Oh, so yeah, that might be. And we were dilly dallying around too. Figured while we're out here, we can check out the modern Icarus station. Yeah, so now when I see people uh, complaining about they got killed in the Black Kite mission, it's like, yeah, you pussies. <laughs> you headbutted the ship to death. <laughs> I fucking did it with hand-to-hand -hand combat. Yeah. Just hit the hero. Just got, got the, a couple. the reclaimer into melee and kicked its ass. Give it a good uppercut down by that big claw. It's got a glass chin. <laughs> Hilarious. Yeah, it's a new station I've never been to. Yeah, some of these new stations are pretty cool. Yeah, I've never been to any of these. I know they're really expensive. So this must be a refinery station, right? It's got all those tanks and stuff down here. Oh, have you seen what they did with the refinery uh, bonuses for these new stations? No. <laughs> so, you know, like all the stations had like little, you know, plus or minus, you know, for different things. And they were all in like the two, one, two or three percent. So you could get like... You know, minus two percent, or like I go to crew L one because it's plus three percent for quantanium. So there's nothing more than a three percent up or down. All the new refineries have minus twenty percent quantanium, 
and one of them has minus 25% spontaneum. So people were like, what the fuck? I guess they don't want you like mining spontaneum in these out of these new ones. But fucking 25%, that is just ridiculous. Yeah, that, that is a huge What's bonus. It's so weird, I hate. I hate seeing the black. Alright, yeah, let's go check this place out. Pad 1. The best pad. Yeah, it's funny, those pad signs don't work for me. I just, I see that the, the, the top of the P and the A, like the whole pad 1 sign has been shifted down and to the right. So I see just the top of the P and the top of the A, but nothing else. If you should, like, maybe delete your shaders or something. Or... Actually, I've done that. <clears throat> In fact, they changed the shaders. No more shaders folder. There's, uh, like, shader files. And so I had a, a shader for 17.0 and 17.1. So I deleted both of those. And it regenerated a new one. It's like nobody's been here. All the NPCs are lined up. Oh, can you store your ship? No, because that should be on the regular pad, I think. Welcome yeah. to the ASOP vehicle retrieval Yeah, so it doesn't system. even show it. I could yep. claim it, but I can't store Please it, visit which us is again. fine. I like, yeah, those, can... I like those hot pads, whatever you call them. To med clinic. Where is the... Here's, see, here's the room with the glass. Oh, so it's further in. It's not all just yeah. spawning right there. That's cool. There's yeah, the some elevators. of these stations have yeah, they have whole new layouts. Okay. And I've seen I've seen this before where the the hangers and halves are off like you know a hallway down a couple turns. <laughs> Which I like, cause I like yeah, I don't want to have every station look the same. That's a quick elevator. All right. Yeah, the the internal elevators are almost too fast. We got admin. It's like the door closes and opens, and it's like, what? Cyclone. Here's the bar and some pizzas. What's over here? Astro Armada. Oh, it's just a sign. Locker room. Nothing? Right. Oh, I should. Sometimes, if you like check in these little areas, you find those confidential terminals. Oh, they have yeah. I could see him putting him on some of these. But I think they're normally out on like the, the, you know, the fours and fives that don't get a lot of traffic. I think it's like Crew L4 has one of them. Like one of them is, oh, here's the juice bar. One of them is in like a little alcove like this. You have to go in and then, and one of them is in one of those like little locker rooms. Um, extensions. They ever put... Oh, can you buy? Oh, you can buy waters here now. Oh, and apples. Nice. There, there used to be nothing purchasable at these juice bars. The so... waters. Oh, they got the. Is the watermelons? Because you used to buy the watermelons at the at the expo for a million apples. Didn't you said you were buying a smoothie? Some. Oh yeah, berry blend smoothie. Yeah. I'm gonna get one of these. I don't see any suit vendors or weapons vendors. Just cassava for its clothing. Let me drink, uh. Let me do something important and drink my berry. <laughs> yeah. Check downstairs again. Maybe I missed it. I don't know. Oh, they give you. It gives you food and. Oh, I didn't. Realize I was just getting low on water. What's your food and water at? Uh oh yeah, seventy two and I was down in under fifty in water. But this berry blend is gonna give me back up to hundred percent food and Oh they have I'll buy a bottle of water here too. That'll get me back up to hundred percent. Very.
Yeah, my animation's broken, but it still is giving me the effect. Yeah, same on my end. I was going to say, it might, might have just been my suit, but if you're getting it too. Oh yeah, here's the clothing store that you saw. Oh, here's one of the places that they used to hide those terminals. Nope. See if it's actually on one of the stations I went to. I just checked the clothing store and they had the the Drake hat. See if they have any unique clothing here. The Aegis hat, bunch of shoes. Nah, I don't waste any time. Yeah, nothing. Wow. Well, okay. And no weapons, no suits. Oh, so what does this have? Just a clothing store only? Yeah, and some food. Yeah, this is where the juice bar was. Yeah, there's a little pizza joint down. Unless it's not in the Galleria, what if they put it down somewhere else? Bar. And you went this way? Yeah, and if you run out here, that's where, that's all just a dead end. Yeah. Well, I guess yeah, this is supposed to be just kind of like rest and relaxation. So bar and bar and a clothing store. Oh, do I have my helmet off still? Yep. Yeah. Don't want to leave it here in local. <laughs> yeah. Well, thankfully we're on the pad, so you just die on the pad. Yeah, like what's around this corner? Maybe there's. Oh yeah. Maybe they, they put them down been... here. I mean that would be new, but it is supposed to be new, isn't it? Oh, that was big. Yeah, like I said, it's, I like when they <clears throat> they make wow. All right, so here's pretty an easy bag. Here's a noodle bar. That's it though. Yeah, this has a holy, uh, I like these guys are all in, in half step. <laughs> I went to some station like that and all the NPCs were lined up like this, like right in the doorway, but there was you know, like double the number of this. So I had to you know, figure out a way through. <laughs> New mini game and just dodging these NPCs. A big hospital. Well, I guess back to Microtech. Oh, I get to see your ship too, since I guess I was in it. It says pad one, cut the steel. Oh, did you get in an elevator? Yeah, oh, I got in. We got in different ones. That's my goal, right? There's only there's only one elevator door, so I wonder what happens if both elevators go to the same destination. Thirty k kill, kicks everyone off the server. <laughs> my okay. my guess is it'll put us both in the same elevator and the door will open. Yep, and there you are. Oh. <laughs> We were stress testing the game. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so I get why they're doing hangers, but I think I'm almost always going to use these pads unless I'm longing in or out. It, well, this is the first time I've used the uh, the elevator. I, I, I've just landed on them and refueled and repaired and took right back off. This is the first time I've actually used the elevator to go in. What guns are on this back one? Um... <laughs> This is a, the same yellow jacket as on the sides, and then I think those are um, badgers. 
Yeah, they kind of. I was gonna say they look. And they might be the one that's the size one. I forget what those are called. A bulldog. Bulldogs. Yeah, those might be bulldogs. I guess I can look real quick. Let's see. Um, guns. Oh, you might have to go into the remote turret. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. All right, so microtech. So. Yeah, I'm gonna get drink the water. Hold on. Yep. Oh. Manu, stop. <laughs> 